Hello everybody and welcome back to the Wattpad Book Club. I'm your host Phoenix and today I got my, my best friend in the whole wide world, my good old friend Sage. Don't you dare sugarcoat what's about to happen right now. You're my best friend and I, I would do anything for you. <laughs> except You're my mo You are my mortal enemy and I will go to the ends of the earth to make sure that I get you back one day. Huh? <laughs> Uh, yeah, you, exactly. You, you okay? You meant like get back at me? I thought you meant get. I thought okay. My brain's deteriorating. <laughs> Good. <coughs> the brain rot's getting to me. The the swooning for Stan's dating sim is really taking a, a hit on my mental health. <laughs> Ew. What do you mean, ew? You never look. Listen, it's Ford. You're telling me that you wouldn't. I am telling you that I wouldn't quite confidently, actually. <laughs> Weirdo. All right. <laughs> anyway, the wheel was spun, and it picked on my choice. And Sage hasn't been here in like three weeks. <laughs> so now, mm -hmm. three weeks later, I get my decision of reading an SMG three four fan fiction that I found and I really liked. So, are you excited, Sage? <laughs> No, I'm just gonna be honest with you, no. <laughs> oh, okay. Don't be me the author, alright? I like this author. Don't- whatever this British person says, don't listen to them. Don't block me on your Wattpad, please. <laughs> Ominous potato, I am after you. <laughs> don't be mean to them. They make some good shit. When, when I find you, <laughs> trust me, it will be painful. <laughs> Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. Ricky, when I catch you, Ricky. <laughs> Potato when I catch you, potato. <laughs> anyway, this is called The Life We Could Have, an S and G three four fanfiction. Uh <laughs> and uh, I like the cover of it. It's really nice. They draw all the art themselves, by the way. Wow. Yeah, I know, you're very impressed. <laughs> I'm so impressed. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Like like say said, this is from ominous underscore potato. It says ongoing, but it's a one shot, so this is never gonna get updated ever again. And it says, I and I, "Wow, <laughs> can you stop being so negative?" For five no, minutes? <laughs> we're not even no, like three I minutes in, and you're like, "Oh, this, I want to kill my." <laughs> I've been wanting to kill myself for the past three weeks because of the horrific countdown I've had to go through. It's fine. After this hour, you're done. And then move on unless, to the strategy. Unless that <laughs> fucking wheel curses me again. You'll be fine, I promise. Okay, I'm it's, about to scrap the wheel. It says, and I quote, After SNG4's guardian pod gets a virus, he is somehow transported into reality where he and SNG3 are Dating? That can't be right. They're ex-rivals. There's not a single reality that they could be together, right? Inspired by a, an, a, what does that say? A racer mick fan fiction I read a few few years ago. Good for, good for you. <laughs> Man, I love fan uh, fiction. Yeah. Well done. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Let me... Oh yeah, let me just double check. Finger is replaced with nublet. <laughs> I love Nublet. <laughs> I know you love Nublet. You've renamed yourself Nublet. Yeah, because it's beautiful. <laughs> Alright. Let me grab my little coin. Do you want to be heads or tails to read first? Listen. <laughs> tails never fails, but I swear to God, if it gives me read first, I am sh I'm not shitting you. I will jump out the window. <laughs> All right, tails you read, heads I read. <laughs> You're not near a window, are you? I am very close to a window. <laughs> Here, I'll even send you proof. It landed on tails. <laughs> oh. It landed on tails. <laughs> I'm so sorry uh, for your love. Uh, here you go. Here's the evidence. It's it's tails. 
I'm not inviting you to my funeral. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right, here we go, everybody. Let's enjoy ourselves, shall we? Yeah. Just, just read how much you're willing to read. But don't read one paragraph and pawn it off to me, dipshit, alright? <laughs> I will read the first sentence and then it's all up to you from there. Bro, come on, man. Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> it was just supposed to be a normal day. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> so, SMG4 wanted one regular day where he isn't being attacked by a stupid eldritch monster. That's how I feel about you. I'm an eldritch monster? Yes, I just want one normal day without being attacked by you. Yeah, I like my, my hey, hey Sage, hey Sage, and you're like, it's fucking two in the morning, what do you want? Yeah, you ringing me last night, three o'clock in the morning, just about to block out for the night, and you were like, hey, you want to read about our fan fiction? <laughs> I don't sound like that. You do. Fuck you. <laughs> But of course, that was too much to ask. The crew didn't know what it was. Was it SMG Zero, Niles, Mr. Puzzle? They couldn't say. But something was damn determined to get itself into a Guardian pod. And it just so happened that that pod belonged to SMG4. Don't let it get near the USB! <laughs> Which I know what this thing is capable of! <laughs> you unshafted. As the SMG4 group fought furiously against this weird glitchy inky mass. I don't get why we can't just let it take the stupid pod. It would be a lot easier, Bob said in his usual robotic tone, flashing at the monster. That wasn't very robotic, but in my defense, I don't know these characters. I know them in my head. They live there rent free. <laughs> no, that's good. I'm going to butcher them for you. Thanks. Hell no! I don't want that thing anywhere near my USB, Four shouted. Him and Three had their hands linked as they were using their meme guardian powers to hold back the creature. The glitch suddenly thrashed, a tentacle at the two. Thinking quickly, SMG4 shouted, Look out! And jumped on top of SMG3. Let's go! Knocking, <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> <Shut up. laughs> knocking him to the ground and narrowly avoiding the tentacle. Don't make this worse for me. <laughs> I'm sorry. Go sit in your corner again. No. And there's two readings in a row where you have to go to the corner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're right, it is! <laughs> <laughs> that was a close one, Four panted. He looked at Three, who was still under him. You okay? Get off me, you moron, Three shouted, blushing as he shoved his guardian partner off of him. Ow, jeez, you're welcome, Four said sarcastically. Can you two stop your old married couple bickering for like five minutes, Maggie shouted, as she took several shots at the monster. I don't know how long we can hold this thing back. We need to move the USB, SMG2 <laughs> said to one. One nodded in agreement, and the two linked hands, SMG4's USB, rose out the ground. This alerted the monster, and it stopped attacking Luigi inst and instead in charge for the pod. Stop it! You can't <laughs> let it into the pod! <laughs> You've given every character the same voice except for SMG1, I love it. <laughs> Yes, I, 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 this is how SMG1 sounds to me. <laughs> Shouted to 3 and 4. SMG grabbed 3's hand and activated their powers. They confronted a few local memes into energy and channeled them through Mario, making the Italian grow inside. I like how it specifically says that he's Ita like the Italian. <laughs> yeah, that's like, like saying like Phoenix, the bitch, you know? <laughs> <laughs> or Sage the Sa British. <laughs> Sage the tortured, more like. <laughs> <laughs> the glitch made a jump for the USB and Mario caught it midair. The crew cheered as the monster was finally strained and three and four breathed a sigh of relief. That was a close one. I don't even want to think about what could have happened if that thing got into my USB, SMG4 said. Well, it's a good thing we'll never have to find out, three said. 
Hey Mario, can you crush this thing already? I don't want to hold on to Four's hand any longer than I have to. Yeah, you do. Shut up. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie. Mario <laughs> gave a thumbs up and began to squeeze the glitch in his fists. SMG34 turned to three and gave him a look. Wait, what's that supposed to mean? He asked, raising an eyebrow. What? I just don't like holding hands with a guy for this long. Totally ruins my image of being a badass lone wolf. Three shrugs. What? <laughs> you know, just for saying that, you are my least favorite. It's like that image that Luke sends of the uh, like the wolf ripping their shirt off <laughs> and like that like the album <laughs> being wolf. <laughs> <laughs> that is how I felt before I picked up the phone. <laughs> Four scoffed at this. Oh, please, you ruined that image a long time ago. I did not. Did too. Oh, yeah? When? SMG3, uh, SMG4 smoked at his guardian partner. Oh, SMG4, we can make another perfect video together. We're friends! Four said in his best SMG3 voice. He made sure to draw out the friends part. Okay, you go. Alright. <sighs> <laughs> Stop looking at me like that! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Hold on, I'm turning this little guy around. There you go. <laughs> oh shit, he fell. <laughs> what? <laughs> leave him alone, leave the nubbler. <laughs> you leave I know him you his that nubblets <laughs> out of here! <laughs> <laughs> SMG3 blushed angrily. I only said that so you don't want to let me fall to my death. Oh yeah, what about the time I saved you from the Cocomelon baby? Y you saved me, SMG4. Four overly dramatically mocked three again, angering the other SMG. Shut up, that crazy TV guy was screwing with my head at the time. Stop trying to deny it, three. You've gone soft, SMG4 teased. I have not. I could still kick your ass if I wanted to, three insisted. Aw, oh, you, you mean you would hurt your friend? I don't think you would. You care about me too much, for smirked, enjoying how wound up three was getting. I do not care about you, and I never will. I am not your friend, and I don't want to be, three snapped. Four was surprised by his sudden outburst. Man, he was really defensive about this. Bro, chill out, it was just a joke, four, four said. No, it's not just a joke. I hate being around you. Your stupid jokes make me want to die. Mom, is this like you yelling at me? <laughs> yes, I feel like. Are you? I hate to say it. I hate to say it, but I'm feeling like a spiritual connection towards the way this person is writing this guy specifically. This is me talking to you right now. I hate you. <laughs> I mean, I always kind of saw myself as an SMG4 anyway, so I guess this kind of checks out, so... <laughs> Why you gotta be so mean to me? <laughs> I hate that you just said that you see yourself as an SMG4. I really Why hate Why am I kidding? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> like, how you kidding Blitzo? Like, like, I... This is my thing. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you should be. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your stupid jokes make you want to die. You're annoying as fuck, and you always had to be on at the center of everything and have all your all eyes on you. But what's not all about you? You just ruined everything, and we always had to clear it up after you. And I'm sick of it. I swear, if it wasn't for this meme guardian bullshit, I'd stay in the internet graveyard for all eternity. So if I could be as far away from you as possible, God, I hate you, S. <laughs> I really fucking hate you. This is you yelling at me. <laughs> yeah, it really is. I. I feel so connected right yeah. now. When we get done with this fanfiction, I'll be like, So, Sage, what'd you think? You're like, I fucking hate you. Go. It's gonna be like that Dr. Phil thing. It's like, I hate you. Go die. Give me $200. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm only doing this because I have to. I don't like you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> After three had finished, there was a silence between the two meme guardians. Three didn't feel like he could bring himself to look at four in the eyes after what he just said, but it really seems to be the only way for him to get him to stop making fun of him. Whatever. Three could just get his USB USB crap over with and then go back home. Him and four would probably ignore each other for a few days, but, but always did that after a fight. He'll be fine. 
That's what Three thought would happen, but then he heard some quiet sniffles come out from SMG4. He knew we fucked up big time. This is me crying after you yelled at me. <laughs> the only difference is, if you started sniffling, I would feel a sense of accomplishment. <laughs> That's so fucked up. That's so <laughs> <I> mean. <laughs> Good. Asshole. <laughs> <laughs> SMG3 dared to glance up at 4 and was instantly flooded with regret. The blue meme guardian was red in the face, lip quivering with tears rolling down his cheeks. He was desperately trying not to cry. It was clear 3's harsh words had given had given to him and he tried to muffle his sorrows by biting his lips shut. Seeing SMG4 like this, 3 f felt wrecked. Hey, wait, 4. I, I didn't mean... 4 didn't care what he had to say. He was too hurt right now. All he wanted to do was go away before 3 and all of his friends could see him cry. Four yanked his hand away from three, not realizing that it inadvertently broke their meme guardian connection. Mario instantly shrunk back to his normal size and the glitch monster broke free. Four, wait, no! Uh, f f fuck, what does that say? Three feud. Hold on. You got it, you got it. Futilely? Futilely. Yeah! Yes! Hey. Futilely shouted. <laughs> <laughs> well done! Yay, I did put a gold star next to my name. <laughs> you tried. Yay! I got an I tried sticker instead. <laughs> God. He futilely <laughs> shouted, but it was too late. The virus had entered SMG4's USB and had embedded itself into the Meme Guardian software. Four immediately collapsed on the ground, his vision becoming fuzzy as he tried to move. SMG4? Meggy shouted. <laughs> Three ran over to his partner, but by that point, he was all but unconscious. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Stay with us, Four, come on. He desperately tried to shake the man away, but to no avail. W what's happening? Four, Tari asked, panicked. We don't- wait, oh, this is SMG1. How the fuck did you do his voice? We don't entirely know! <laughs> We don't entirely know that SMG4 <laughs> was still alive, but his consciousness has been affected by whatever this virus is. Unfortunately, we know very little about it, and if we can install an antivirus program in it, then like we did for SMG0, we can hopefully fix everything, SMG1 said. <laughs> in the meantime, you can go get SMG4 to a safe place so that he's comfortable when he wakes up, SMG2 said. SMG3 nodded and picked up his partner. Of course he's calling him his partner. Of course the, the author is calling him his partner. This is beautiful. <laughs> oh. They're gay. <laughs> you make me sick. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Good. <laughs> nodded and picked up his partner, holding him uh, securely in his arms. We'll take him back to the castle. Here... We'll wait for him to wake up, Maggie said, putting a hand on SMG3's shoulder. SMG3 looked down at his unconscious partner with great great worry. It was feeling regret and, rem and remorse in every single way, and he could in any way he could, and in that moment, he could have given almost anything to go back in time and stop himself from opening his big mouth. Damn it, SMG3 muttered, his teeth clenched. Damn it all to hell. Alright, now your turn. <laughs> Oh, okay. what do you mean? <laughs> Fucking <Okay. sighs> Four felt strange. Like his mind was floating through a world of static. He didn't know where he was, to what was going on, so he just allowed his mind to float. Maybe letting go of SMG3's hand wasn't the smartest idea. But he hurt my feelings. I was completely justified in wanting to get away. But now look at you don't have any idea where you are once again. Your friends are picking up after you. SMG4 sighed to himself. Three's words must have had quite the impact on him if he was thinking about them now of all times. He knew Three probably didn't mean it, but these words had to come from somewhere. Maybe Three really didn't like being around him as much as he thought, or as much as he hoped. Oh god, gay drama. <laughs> <laughs> As much as he wished it wasn't true, Four really did care about Three. He wanted him to be happy and comfortable, just as he would with any of his friends. But Four couldn't deny that it was slightly different with Three. Sure, he could lie to himself, convince himself that every time they hugged or held hands, 
Thor didn't wish the contact would last just a little bit longer. He could pretend that he wasn't impressed by SMG3 single-handedly serving every customer in his coffee shop or that his stomach didn't totally erupt with butterflies when he saw SMG3's secret soft side come out as he played with Egg Dog. <laughs> I heard you, ask? I heard you, but yeah, yeah, ask. Is Egg Dog literally a dog that is an egg? Yeah, I can show you a picture. It's it's like a little meme of like an egg an egg that is that like acts like a dog. That is strange. <laughs> He's really cute. <laughs> I have my doubts, but okay, question answered. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> but under all of that denial, lies, pretending, and pettiness, one thing stood out that was <coughs> irrefutable. SMG four wanted more with SMG three. <laughs> Part okay. <of> him- <laughs> Josh! I'm sorry. <laughs> Naughty corner. Fine, I will. I'm getting the other numbers. No. A part of him deep down wanted to tre- cherish and love this man for all that he was. Regardless of their past, Paul wanted to ignore it all and just be able to call SMG3 his own. To make him happy and spend the rest of his days being there for each other as much more than friends or guardian partners, just partners. Of course, <laughs> this part of Thor was already, always stumped out by his heart every time it decided to rear its ugly head. But right now, Thor couldn't find it within him to stomp it out. Thor wanted to indulge in this fantasy for a little bit longer as his mind was infested with static. After what must have been hours of drifting, Thor finally woke up. His body ached as he regained consciousness and he squinted up at the ceiling, realizing he was in his own room. What the hell happened, he thought to himself. Thor glanced around the room as best as he could. Everything looked the same. Why do I feel so... Thor then felt movement in his hand. He looked down and his eyes widened as he saw SMG3's hand clasping his own. Turns out SMG3 was sitting by his bed, looking at his phone. SMG3, the very same man who had caused all of this to begin with. Had he been waiting there this whole time? He probably just felt bad for what he said after all. Three, SMG4 weakly said, trying to prop himself up. Three looked up and an expression of relief and joy flooded his face. Four! Holy (laughs) crap, you're okay! He said with a smile. Alright, you deserve an Oscar. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> wow, thank you. I, I, uh, I'm quite enjoying butchering all of your characters' voices. <laughs> I don't know how you could have made them sound Australian anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> it's Australian. Yeah. Oh, good day, mate. <laughs> I, I, I don't, I'm not. I'm not even going to try. <laughs> Without warning, three suddenly leapt forward and scooped four up into a tight hug. SMG4's face turned a bright red and any drowsiness he was previously feeling left his body in an instant. He froze as SMG3 squeezed him so hard he thought he would burst. The purple SMG3 buried his face in Thor's neck as a few tears welled in his eyes. Aww. (laughs) How how gay. (laughs) Unsure of what brought about this sudden affection. Four gave three a confused but genuine pat on the back as he hugged him tightly. Eventually, Four returned the hug, choosing to ignore why three was acting the way he was. He was probably just worried about me. Aw, softy. God. (laughs) 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 He couldn't hold that one back. It just fell out, I'm sorry. (laughs) You were gonna get to like seven points of this and you'd be like, mmm, you. (laughs) Yeah. Every word that is escaping my mouth, I'm trying my best to make it seem <laughs> like I am happy to be here. <laughs> but I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> However, four thoughts suddenly, qu- quickly, left his mind as SMG3 turned his head slightly and gave him a kiss on the cheek before continuing to hug him. Four could have sworn that his heart skipped a beat when three did this. What the hell? He kissed me? He kissed me? Why the hell would he do that? Did he really miss me that much? 
Was he that worried about me? <laughs> Paul's mind was so clouded with questions and confusion that he barely registered when Three let go of him and sat back in his seat. Are you okay? Nothing hurts, right? Do you need anything? A glass of water, maybe? Three unleashed a barrage of questions whilst Paul was still trying to come to terms with what happened. Eventually, Paul managed to gather his thoughts enough to mumble. A water would be nice. Three smiled at him and stood up. He gave Four another kiss on the cheek, turning the blue SMG's face even redder and left the room. I think he managed to get his heart rate back to normal. Four took it upon himself to figure out what the hell was going on. Why was Three acting like this? Is this his way of apologizing? No. No, something is definitely wrong here. I just need to figure out what. Four stood up and started poking around his room trying to see if anything had changed or was misplaced. Perhaps it's a simulation, a fake world to trick me into staying here forever, or maybe it's a dream, or perhaps I'm just crazy. There has to be some kind of explanation as to what's going on. You read. <laughs> Damn. You're like, I'm done with this shit. <laughs> yeah, I tried. It, it's your turn. <laughs> Four looked over his desk and noticed a framed picture that wasn't there before. He picked it up to inspect it and almost immediately dropped it in shock. How? A wooden frame- In the wooden frame was a picture of him and Three together. Three's arms slugged over four shoulders with- Whilst- I can- I guess see, see, I did it. <laughs> with four. Yes. Giving his mean partner a kiss on the cheek. They both seemed happy there, together. A rare moment for four and three. Only thing, this event definitely didn't happen. At least not to him. Four flipped over the picture frame to see a date written alongside the message. 18. Oh, it's written backwards. So it's supposed to be March 18th, 2024. Bitch, okay. that's written correctly. <laughs> what, I don't. What, you. Okay, in America, we write it month, day, and year, alright? Oh Get my off my no. back. America, <laughs> in America, we do this. Oh, it's backwards. No, it's not. Yeah, it, Happy one year, my love. <laughs> and that's what it says. <laughs> one year? How the hell do you mean one year? There's no way. That would mean they started going out a little after Peach's castle was destroyed. But they were currently- They certainly weren't a couple last time Fort checked. What was going on? Did that glitch somehow change the timeline? Then it hit SMG4. What if the timeline wasn't what changed? What if I changed? When the glitch went into my USB, I must have somehow swapped realities with an alternate universe of myself whose USB was also corrupted. Except in this universe, me and three are somehow dating? Awesome? <laughs> terrible? Poggers? Wow, why are you saying terrible? <laughs> Let these gay men be gay, bro. <laughs> I'd let anybody else be gay apart from these two. Oh. <laughs> Disgust How do you me. feel about lesbians? I love lesbians. <laughs> Valid. <laughs> the silence really scared me. <laughs> I was so just drinking, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was drinking my black tea peach. Now with more fiber or some shit like that. As the theories and exclamations ran through SNG4's head, he didn't notice that three snuck up behind him and wrapped his arms around him, resting, <laughs> resting his head on the crick of his neck. I, I, I forgot about this. I forgot I'm gonna have to read this shit out loud. Fuck <laughs> 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 <Thank> you. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> no, you could- No, actually, you know what? This is good, because you had to hear me get really close and personal my mic, like so many other guests have had to hear in their ears. <laughs> no, you do this every <laughs> reading. Back up from the mic. <laughs> hey, honey. He's- you. He's... No! I can smile! <laughs> Four jumped about the contact and slipped out of SMG3. SMG3's embrace, face red. Oh, oh, hey, three. He stuttered. Three raised an eyebrow at him and offered him the glass of water. I, uh, got your water, your drink, whatever. I can't fucking read, he said. <laughs> oh. Yes, thank you. I just, that's exactly what I needed, <laughs> he said awkwardly. As Four took the glass from Three, their hands briefly touched, sending what felt like rushes of electricity up with SNG Four's arm. He was quick to yank the glass away and turn away as he chugged it in hopes of calming himself down in his burning face. 
We gave him a look of concern and placed a hand on her shoulder, causing the blue guardian to jolt slightly. Hey, are you sure you're okay, babe? You're acting odd. Huh? Odd? No, I'm not acting odd. I'm completely normal. Just regular old S&D 4. That's me. <laughs> Four said with an unconvinced grin plastered on his face. Hmm. Maybe that glitch is still affecting you? SNG-1 said that the antivirus program will take a day or two to install. Three and suggested as he cupped SNG-4- Wait, he, did he do what? <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe I should be put down. Yeah, you should be. I'm gonna euthanize you. I almost did a spit take. I- I almost did that. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Force cheeks instantly turned a deep shade of red as he tried his best to avoid eye contact with the man in front of him. Yeah, that's probably all that's going on. Force stammered. Three smiled and continued and moved his free hand to cup the other side of Force's face, forcing him to look at him. The blue guardian stared wide-eyed at his mean partner, who had who had nothing but a look of genuine affection in his face. Okay. You would tell me if something is bothering you, right? He asked. Four hesitantly nodded. Uh, of course! He wasn't used to this much affection, especially from three of all people. Hmm, <clears throat> alright then. The two same motions lasted for a few seconds. Three still gently cupping Four's face at, at the, the ladder. I, I'm so good at this. <laughs> As the latter tried not to make it obvious how much he really was freaking out in internally. <laughs> As if Forrest by panic could not get any worse. So he began to lean in close, his eyes slowly lid. The world around SMG4 froze as a million thoughts rushed through his head. Oh god, oh god, three's going in for a kiss. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What do I do? He thinks I'm his long term boyfriend. I barely even kiss anyone before. What do I do? <laughs> I hate to do this to you. <laughs> but I'm no, 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 you read this shit now. No, 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 popcorn, popcorn. <laughs> no, 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 time out, time out, time out. You keep reading. <laughs> Why? What do you mean you hate to do this to me? Why are you clocking out? <laughs> that means it's something bad. It's nothing bad. I don't know if I can take, like, all right, fine, I'll do it. Just leave me alone. <laughs> Don't put it on me. <laughs> but his lips so. F <laughs> but his lips look so soft, though. No, no, come on, four, pull yourself together. You can't indulge in your weird rivalry crush right now. It's not right. My SNG three would never want to kiss me, but this one does. This one. This could be my only chance to know what it's like to date SNG three. It's still not right. It's not your SNG three. You can't just kiss him. But if I don't, he'll be upset. Just explain them that you're not his four. But I could be. You're not. But I want to be. Four, it's wrong. It's. It feels so right, though. Surely it. It could. Surely it couldn't hurt to indulge just a little bit. Four. Just. Just one little. <laughs> you know you'll regret it. Just let me indulge. Let me live out my stupid fantasy for one day, and then go back. And then he can go back to hating my guts. Right now, let me love love him. <laughs> okay, can I popcorn it to you now? <laughs> okay. Yay! <laughs> I know this is going to be like the worst bit in the fucking book because I have to read it. <laughs> no! Okay, yeah, it is then. <laughs> <laughs> With his internal voice finally <laughs> silent. <laughs> Falling closer and met SMG 3's kiss in the middle. It was sweet and gentle. Three held four's head as SMG three placed his hand on three's hips. What the fuck? <laughs> he fell along his curves, making sure to memories every bump and dip in his partner's skin. <coughs> oh, you actually Eat made it. me do it. You actually made me do it. I just spit water all over myself. Yeah. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> because. It was really oh. funny. Well, I thought it would be funny. Okay. Anyway. Oh, God, I got water all over myself. I gotta kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> no, it'll 
<laughs> oh, my eyes are watering. <laughs> oh god, as the kiss continued, Form found himself never wanting to let go of the man in his arms. Scared that if he did, he'd lose this moment with him. That he'd suddenly be back with the SMG3 who hates him. The three that would never look at him the way this three did. The three that would never want to kiss him or love him how the three in his arms did. Four could feel three begin to pull away from the kiss, but four, ever determined to not let the moment end just yet, leant in closer, forcing the kiss to continue. Three was surprised, but shrugged it off and began to run his fingers through his boyfriend's hair as they shed the silver no, 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 no. act of passion. <laughs> no, 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 that said he ran his nublets through his boyfriend's <laughs> I haven't changed the world. I did. I'm not going back and reading it. Well, I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> he ran his nublets through his boyfriend's hair as they share this act of passion. <laughs> <laughs> and after a few minutes, Four finally released them from their kiss. Both guardians were red in the face as they looked at each other. Finally, Three gave the other man a smirk. My, my, that was certainly passionate. What's got you all lovey-dovey, he teased. Four blush worsened as he looked away. Nothing, I just missed being with you and when I was asleep and you wanted to kiss me, so I just thought that... Ugh, ugh. <laughs> whoa, whoa, sweetheart, you're all right. I was just teasing you, you goof. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> he chuckled. I'm gonna go hold my nublet. <laughs> As he gave for a playful punch on the arm, Four awkwardly laughed at this, and the two smiled at each other. Come on, Glitchy, let's make something for dinner, then sit down and watch a movie or something. You must be exhausted after the whole glitch monster thing, Three said as he grabbed Four's hand and led him to the kitchen. Four stared at the other guardian with admiration as he was dragged along behind him. He smiled, really making sure to appreciate the feeling of Three's hand in his own. Man, I'm sorry, I feel sorry for the <laughs> version of me I swapped with. He must be having an awful time. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Fuck you right now. <laughs> Oh wait, this is pictures? <laughs> this is what? This is pictures? I see a picture coming up, but that won't be for a little bit. <laughs> I don't see the picture yet, and I'm so grateful that I don't. I almost don't want to scroll down. Are you? Oh yeah, you don't have a computer. I don't know if this will show up for you on the phone. I hope it doesn't. I really hope it doesn't. <laughs> Damn. In the kitchen, the two cooked together as if they were a married couple. They were so in sync with each other's movements and constantly aware of the other's face that it felt as if they were doing a dance of some kind. Four giggled as three wrapped his arms around him and continuously kissed his cheek as he was stirring ingredients. Three smiled in adoration as they spun around each other every time they needed to get by. Four beamed when three actually laughed at his stupid food puns instead of calling them stupid like his three does. And his face definitely didn't go red when he felt, <laughs> What? <laughs> well, they're dating. It's fine. It's not like... <laughs> anyway. He <laughs> felt SMG3 slightly slap his ass as he walked by. Ha ha. Definitely not. <laughs> I see the picture. <laughs> I, I don't see it yet, technically. I, I can see the, like, just the hats. I see the fucking picture. Oh, once they <laughs> cooked the house dinner, the two lovers sat down on the couch. Four made sure to sit on the opposite end of the couch like he usually did with three. But when he saw the purple mean guardian give a disappointed frown, he quickly remembered that this version of them were dating so he could sit as close as he wanted to. After a few hours had passed, the couple sat cuddled up together on the sofa, exchanging sweet, meaningful kisses. The movie, long forgotten, plates completely empty. Oh god, now I have to look at the picture. <laughs> well, why are you acting like this is hurtful to I you? I never saw this, okay? This oh. is probably the best time you are having. <laughs> You're acting like it's the most painful thing you've ever been through. Shut up! <laughs> Sometimes I As think they get embarrassed. Shut up. 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> As they three pulled his boyfriend closer to him, said that he was oh now full sitting in his lap. <laughs> he smiled as his arms wrapped around his waist, letting him be as close as he physically could to the money blow. Your turn. God Popcorn. Damn it. <laughs> Fines, whatever. This is probably actually good that you did this. <laughs> Why? From what I remember reading, it's probably just a good thing that you popcorned here. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> well, do you want to read it? No! Yes, I thought. <laughs> On the other hand, Ford was completely lost in the moment. He had been craving this kind of relationship with SNG3 for so long, and now that it was actually happening, he could barely hold himself back. It felt so liberating to finally be able to love that man as much as he deserved to be loved. To hold him and kiss him as much as he wanted to. Sure, it wasn't his SMG3, but at least it was an SMG3. This could probably be his only chance to experience a relationship with the man that he loved so dearly. And damn it, he was going to savor every damn second of it. <laughs> is this gonna be- if this- is this me if I like astro project myself into Hasbin Hotel? <laughs> yeah. For fucking like box. <laughs> well, hey. I hate Vox and I hate SMG34. Don't forget about Sanji and Stanford. Yeah. <laughs> Everything that you like, I hate automatically. <laughs> oh. Well, I hate to tell you this, but I really like Adam. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> well, toss him in the inferno. <laughs> mm. How did this version of me ever work up the balls to ask out this perfect man to date me? Ford wondered this as he felt. Oh. <laughs> oh! Um, I, I'm putting them. I'm turning my plushie away. <laughs> I'm glad you're reading this. Yeah, see? You did a good job. <laughs> Why? Uh, <laughs> I just read ahead accidentally. <laughs> Why did you do that? Because I looked down and I literally <laughs> read a sentence and it was probably the worst sentence I could have landed on to accidentally read. <laughs> For wonder this as he felt Reese's tongue gently press against his lips. <laughs> he parted his lips slightly, allowing <laughs> the other man to explore his mouth. <laughs> For furrowed his eye- eyebrows and <clears throat> and whimpered slightly at the feeling. Three was so gentle and, and delicate with his actions that it just made Four want to melt in his arms and kiss him all night long. Three leaned closer and very softly bit for his lips, signaling him to stop. The two meme guardians pulled away, both red in the face and panting slightly, a, str- a, st- a thin string of saliva hanging between their lips. Why'd you stop? Four asked, worried that you did something wrong. It's getting late. We should go to bed. Three softly smiled, four smiled back and nodded in agreement. And then I do a little scroll. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. I think. Hold on. This is getting long, so it's not doing this right. <laughs> The two guardians stood up and walked back to Four's room, their hands interlocked. Once inside, they got in- they each got into a pair of pajamas, Four trying his best not to peek over at SMG3 taking his shirt off. Unfortunately, Three caught him sneaking side glances at him. The purple meme guardian smirked and strutted over to his boyfriend, who nervously looked away as his face reddened. <laughs> Is this the sentence you read? <laughs> no, I read the saliva one and oh. I wanted to- Bah. <laughs> You're like, I read it and I wanted to kill myself. <laughs> yeah, that was the moment that I realized I made the right choice to popcorn. <laughs> I said you did. <laughs> like what you see? Three ass. Leading ghost SG4 who was avoiding eye contact at all costs. Uh, I, I wasn't. It's it's not that, that I... It, it's not what it... It's not what it looks like. I swear I, I wasn't looking. I swear I just... uh. SNG4 spluttered, his face overtaken with a furious blush. SNG3 grinned mischievously as he moved his hands to gently hold SNG4's chin. He. <laughs> he tilted. Shut up! <laughs> he tilted Four's head to face him as the, fl- the flustered guardian's eyes widened as he stared at the gorgeous man in front of him. Three smirked as he watched Four struggle to look at anything other than him, than his bare chest. Aw, oh, Glitchy, you embarrassed? Wait, no, why would I be embarrassed? <laughs> Shut up! Well, you need an Oscar for that. I do. <laughs> A Phoenix Oscar. 
Yeah. You get an Oscar for getting going through this. <laughs> like an arc. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you get the the lost it all award. <laughs> uh, I feel like my Oscar is going to be Verosica merch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I I probably should ship this out soon, huh? <laughs> I mean I mean <laughs> We haven't done the the thing yet, so I haven't completed my end of the bargain just yet. Yeah. <laughs> Three placed a teasing hand on Four's chest as he leaned closer and whispered, "You know, you could just say you wanted to look. Wouldn't be the first time you see me without clothes on." <laughs> ah! <laughs> I deserve an Oscar for that one. <laughs> <laughs> elf, elf, help me, <laughs> Jaleen. Someone! Even Luke, I don't care! <laughs> if four wasn't Fluster then, he sure as hell was now. He was just staring. It was starting, my bad. Starting to feel extremely hot under the under the collar now. It was acknowledged both the physical contact and the implication of three's words. Whatever this four is, he is a lucky guy. Are, are you gonna put a shirt on or. Three shrugged. Yeah, I think you prefer me with that one tonight. He <laughs> he winked at his partner, who had to turn away to hide his blush, which had not left his face for a while now. Three crawled on to the bed at, as four finished getting changed into his pajamas. Once dressed, he slid in next to his partner and curled into a ball of some sort, too scared to move in case it made three uncomfortable in, in some way. The purple guardian rolled his eyes and pulled four closer to him, bringing his face right up to three's chest. Moron. <laughs> Re muttered with a smile as he ran a hand through four's soft black hair. <laughs> Do you regret coming into this show? <laughs> I regret everything. Good. I'm glad I'm doing my job. Mm. Oh god. <laughs> I forgot about don't, all this! Don't- oh god! Don't- oh god! <laughs> For Galt as he leaned against three. A part of him desperately wanted to reach his hands out and cuddle with three, but the annoying part of his brain was still screaming at him to stop indulging in his fantasy for being with three. It was never going to happen in his world, so he should be honest and stop it from happening here too. But damn it, Four just couldn't help himself. He knew how- who knew how long it would be left before the antivirus software was installed? needed to make the most out of his time here with three before he was brought back to his cruel unloving reality <laughs> finally four wrapped an arm around sng3 and let out a sigh three looked down at him and smiled everything all right honey and eh, it's complicated four sighed as he began tracing patterns on sng3's skin <laughs> hmm do you need a distraction for <laughs> sorry <laughs> <laughs> not the not the crying. I want to die. <laughs> there is a tear escaping my eye right now. I need to see this. <laughs> three three bounced his eyebrows sedu seductively, causing four to chuckle slightly. But then Four actually started thinking about the offer. Once again, his internal debates started up again. Oh, Jesus Christ. Mm, please no. Please no. <laughs> this could be what This could very well be my own one and only chance to be with SMG4 and sorry, 3 with this way. But it's not our SMG3. Our SMG3 would never do this. Not to mention he only offered because he thinks you're a different SMG4. But I've come so far. Just a few more hours and it'll be like, none of this ever happened. I can have my fantasy and no one will get hurt. It's wrong. I can't risk losing this chance. Uh, uh, okay. Four said timidly. <laughs> I forgot about it. I, okay? I said I forgot. <laughs> I'm so livid right now. <laughs> At least you're not having to read it. <laughs> Three looked surprised at this. R really? Y yeah, fuck it, why not? <laughs> Three grinned and pulled four up to his eye level with him. Why the hell not, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. 
Help, help, help. <laughs> he bit his lip before the two lovers leaned in and locked lips. Their kisses were familiar, were similar to the ones before, tender and loving. With a dormant lust hidden behind each one, they were both going slow, making sure to fully savor the moment between them. And then I'm gonna have to do a scroll. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta see what I have to read next. <laughs> You'll read eventually. Just let me get through this. Or... <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> well, that's too damn bad. You came in. <laughs> As their kisses got more heated, the three began to slowly climb on top of SG4, leaning over to him and entwining their legs. <laughs> Red face and drunk on love, Four hazily opened his eyes, and you'd see he really appreciated the sight above him. He held Three's face with his, by his cheeks as they kiss, making soft noises of enjoyment the further they went. God, you're so beautiful, SG4, Three whispered. Four blushed at the comment and continued to make out with his partner. Three wasn't quite finished, though. You're just so perfect, Four. Everything about you is perfect. Your smile, your face, your body, your jokes. I just, I'm just like the luckiest man alive because I get to call you mine. But at this point... Three had pulled away from Four's lips slightly, so he could drown him in compliments. Four looked as if he was completely dazed by Three's words as he looked at his lover with wide eyes. Butterflies fluttered in his stomach as he stared at the gorgeous man on top of him. Fuck, this is everything I've ever wanted. Why does it feel so... As he, uh, Three leaned down to kiss him again, but before their lips connected, Three br briefly muttered, I love you so goddamn much. Upon hearing these words, Four's eyes widened clarity. He loves me. No, this isn't right. Three can never say that to me. SNU3 doesn't love me. He hates me. He never loved me. Okay, this is now your turn. <laughs> Why? Because it's done, alright? <laughs> okay, good. As long as you weren't giving me the worst part. I- I- you... <laughs> Listen, I- I said it was, it's done, alright? <laughs> Listen to me. <clears throat> Very carefully. Yeah. If I read this and it is the bad part, it's I It's nothing will... bad. I read the red bad part. <laughs> okay, I believe you. If yeah. you betray my trust, I will die. <laughs> tears, tears began to well up in Ford's eyes and trickled down his cheeks as he quietly began to cry at the realization. The man I love more than anything can't stand to be around me. His heart clenched in both pain and heartache. He wanted SMG3 more than anything, but he wanted his SMG3. The SMG3 who teased him relentlessly. The SMG3 who called his jokes unfunny and reeked of... The fuck? I don't know what that says. <laughs> um, Garden fraud. Yay! Yes. <laughs> I bet I said that so wrong. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the SMG3 who had managed a redemption arc so hard that it became a domestic coffee shop owner. The SMG3 he had grown to love and respect over the years. That was the SMG3 he wanted. Even if he knew he could never have it. As his crime became more noticeable, the SMG3 that was currently on top of him immediately pulled away and looked at him with concern. Whoa, hey, Four, you okay? Did I do something wrong? You know, you don't have to do anything if you're uncom- No, no, it's not that. I, I do want two, three. I just, I can't. It's not right. I just. Four then broke down crying again as the two sat up. Three gently rubbed Four's shoulder, hoping to soothe him. Hey, hey, it's okay, Four. You know you can tell me anything. What's bothering you? The Blue Guardian looked up at Three and felt his heart squeeze as he saw the concerned expression on his face. This wasn't fair to him. I, I'm sorry, Four mumbled as he cried. Sweetheart, it's okay. Whatever it is, I'll understand. You're my boyfriend and I want to help you, he smiled. Thor pulled his knees into his chest and buried his face in his arms to hide his tears. But I'm not, though, he said quietly. What? Three asked, the concern a lot more notable now. I'm not your SMG4, he Thor finally admitted with a sigh. Three's face went from one of concern to confusion and anger. What? What do you mean you're not my SMG4? Of course you are, we've been dating for over a year. Are you leaving me for somebody else? Uh, I don't understand, what did I do wrong? Three said with hurt in his voice. 
Thor instantly realized how his wording came across and had to clarify it. N no! Well, no, wait, you misunderstand. I am literally not your SMG4. My consciousness is different from another reality, where things are different. I, I think me and him must have somehow swapped realities when the glitch got into our USB. SMG3 seemed to calm down a bit once Thor explained the situation. That's not to say he wasn't a bit frazzled by it all. Okay, so you are SMG4, just not my SMG4. Yes. And my SMG4 is with your SMG3. Yeah. Right. And you only just realised that is, isn't is your reality? SMG3 asked in disbelief. Four froze up and looked away in shame. Um... Well, oh my god, how long did you know for? Thor gave him an awkward smile, praying that he wouldn't make this SMG3 mad at him too. All day? He said hopefully. All day? And you didn't think to tell me? Three shouted. I'm sorry, I never meant to take it this far. It was a really shitty thing for me to do and I'm really, really sorry. It's just, I wanted this for so long and when you came on to me, I, I couldn't, I just couldn't help myself. It was greedy and stupid of me, but I was so caught up in the moment. I didn't know how to defuse the situation once it had started, and I let it get out of control. Thor hurriedly explained himself to Three, who just sighed. What I still don't understand is why you'd keep it up. Don't you have your own SMG3 back home who you can do all this shit with? Thor paused and looked down as he considered his answer. I mean, I do have an SMG3, it's just he doesn't exactly like me. He said in a defeated tone. What do you mean he doesn't like you? Three asked with an eyebrow raised. He hates me, alright? My SMG34 can't stand me. Fuck, you think I would do all this stuff with him if he gave me the chance? I want to, more than anything in the world. I want to hold him and kiss him for hours on end, do stupid couple shit like going on dates and holding his hand, regardless of our meme guardian roles. <laughs> it's... It's such a strange title to be taken seriously. <laughs> I want to be able to tell him that I love... That I love... Four trailed off as the tears welled in his eyes once again. Fuck, I really do love him. Four thought to himself as he began to cry again. Whilst he let his emotions out, Three put a sympathetic arm around his shoulder, causing Four to lean into him for comfort as he cried. I, I just want my SMG3 to love me, he sniffled. I wish I was good enough for him, instead of just being an annoying, unfunny piece of shit. I wish I wasn't such a thorn in his side, and that I could contribute something good to his life. SMG3's eyes widened, and he pulled SMG4 closer to him to comfort him. Whoa, 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 hang on now. I don't like hearing you talk about yourself in that way. Four looked up at him, and he continued. Look, I'm not going to pretend you can't be annoying or unfunny, and I'm still a little bit mad you hid this reality swap thing from me, but... He took Thor's hand in his own. You're still technically a version of my boyfriend, and I love every single part of my boyfriend. And if I know that I can love any and all versions of SMG4, who's to say that all SMG3s don't feel the same? Because honestly, in my opinion, there is not a single version of me that doesn't love you, SMG4. Even yours, as long as the universe decides we're cosmically destined to be in each other's lives, I can't see a world where I'm not with you for. Three spoke with a genuine smile on his face, his words full of sincerity. A blush dusted both of their cheeks as they smiled at each other. I, Four sighed, I hope you're right. SMG3 nodded before gently pulling both him and SMG4 back onto the mattress. Hopefully by tomorrow the antivirus software will be fully downloaded and you can return to your reality, SMG3 said, stroking SMG4's hair softly. Yeah, although I will fe miss the feeling being loved by an SMG3, Four admitted. Well, if you work up the balls to ask yours out, then maybe you won't feel so alone, Three joked. Four chuckled at this and leant closer to Three. The purple guardian gave him a kiss on the forehead and gently rubbed his back. Four felt his eyelids growing heavy as he allowed Sleepy to take over his brain. Mm, night three, he yawned drowsily. Good night, SMG4. Three sighed, holding him firmly in his arms as the blue guardian fell asleep. Your turn! Yay! <laughs> Popcorn! 
Man, you hated that. <laughs> I really did. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! I was supposed to clock out of work. Hold on. <laughs> Phoenix. Hey. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! I just got an extra fifteen minutes. Let's go. <laughs> oh god. Went to sleep. It didn't take long before Forrest's mind filled with static once again. He drifted through the the fuck the mindscape. I know that word because I just watched Gravity Fall. <laughs> wow. Well <done. laughs> Shut up. I don't need your fucking your nonsense right now. You're patronizing me. What did I do? I said you well breathed. done. You breathed. I said well done. <laughs> Wasn't it wasn't in a nice way. I'm never saying it again. Oh, fuck! What have I done? <laughs> the setting is well best done. not- Thank you. The setting is best not to wait it out until he was back into his own universe. Like last time, he thought about Three's words to him. Could it be really possible for every version of Three to love him? There's no doubt that that version of him loved Four. Would his Three feel the same? I mean, if our- Guardian connection is the same in every universe. I see no reason why our feelings wouldn't be any different. It seemed like the only way to find out was to take take other SMG3's advice and just ask him in person. Sure, their last conversation ended with three screaming at him that he hated him and four being corrupted by a virus, but that's fine. Water under the bridge, I'm sure. <laughs> As he mindlessly floated, <laughs> floated through the, the static world, he could have sworn he saw a glimpse of a familiar blue guardian floating in the opposite direction of him. My other version. The two guardians looked at each other as they briefly passed by, both on their way back to their correct universe. Man, I hope SMG3 isn't too harsh on that guy. I wasn't, my bad, I can't fucking read. Fourth thought to himself as the static wood around him became brighter and less fuzzy. When Four woke up, his body felt heavy, like he was- as if he was just jet lagged from having his consciousness swap from with another universe as he tried his best to figure out what exact where exactly he was. Looking around, it was clear he was in his room, his actual room. It was no longer dark outside, but sunlight had just started seeping in through the window and giving the sky a nice orange tint. Ford tried to sit up, and then he noticed an orange draped over his body. What does that say? Pre ring? Yeah. Oh, peering. <laughs> oh, I can't. Oh, preventing him. I'm sorry. <laughs> preventing him from moving. Looking to his side, his eyes widened in shock as he saw SNG3 cuddling with him next to him. Holy fuck! <laughs> <laughs> he screamed, hurriedly shuffling to the other side of the bed to get as far away from 3 as possible, a blush very prominent on his face. The commotion caused Three to wake up and drowsily sit up straight in the bed. He raised a tired eyebrow at Four. What? What is it? He said in his normal grumpy voice. What are you doing in my bed? <laughs> <laughs> Three looked confused for a moment as he processed Four's question. You asked me to stay here the night? Since you didn't want to be on your own in a new- Wait a second. He looked at Four nervously. Which SMG4 are you? The correct one, you moron. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> there was an awkward silence between the two guardians. Neither one of them knew what to say, and the tension in the room was so thick it could be cut with a knife. They both sat there ex extremely still, neither showing any intention of leaving the bed. Eventually, three spoke up. L look, SMG4, I owe you an apology, he sighed. He looked, causing four to look at him with curiosity. What I said back at the USB... I didn't mean it. It was cruel for me to say, and I deeply regret hurting you like that. Yes, you are annoying and unfunny, but you're also a really great guy. You care about your friends, and you, and you don't ruin everything. It's the opposite, really, and you make everyone's lives better. Even mine. Three quietly muttered the last part as he continued. <laughs> I'm not great at this whole apology thing. Never have been. But when that glitch got into your USB, I was so scared for you. I was worried that you had gotten hurt or changed you, but I didn't want you to change. The four that we all love and, love and know is perfect just the way he is. And we... I don't want any other version of him. Wow, this is so gay. These guys should, like, kiss or something. I don't <laughs> they shouldn't. Oh. <laughs> We've already been through that. We've already been through it. Damn. <laughs> 
Or could feel his heart speeding up faster with, e with each passing second, his cheeks reddened as he listened to SNG3's words. Judging by 3's tone and body language, he genuinely meant what he was saying, which made 4 instinctively happy. He doesn't hate me! <laughs> he allowed a big smile to take over his face as he suddenly leaned closer to SNG3, pulling him into a tight hug. 3 was surprised by the sudden gesture, but soon returned the hug, just as tight. It's alright, 3. I forgive you. Poor smile as he squeezed his partner tighter. I'm glad to hear it. The two pulled apart and finally got out of Four's bed. So, um, how'd you figure out it wasn't me that was here yesterday? Four asked. I guess it was when you started calling me babe and got upset that I was was a bit standoffish about it. He shrugged. Four chuckled. Oh man, I feel sorry for that, Four. What about you? When did you figure out that it wasn't me who was there? Four froze as a, as a blush rose on his face. Oh shit, I need to scroll. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I guess it was when you- mm -hmm. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, it's Elf. Can, can he not? <laughs> for five minutes. <laughs> Wait, Elf? Yeah, he messaged me on Instagram with shit. <laughs> oh. Which you should get, because I can send you cool Wolverine shit I find. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I guess it was when you kissed me. <laughs> He blushed awkwardly. Three's eyes widened as his cheeks reddened ever so slightly. Uh, oh. There was silence between the two as Three tried to find the right words. Did you kiss me back? He asked. Four's face went red with embarrassment and anger. W what kind of question is that? He asked. Well, excuse me. i never exactly been in a situation where my ex-rival kissed an alternative version of myself. What the heck am I supposed to say? I don't know. Not that. Well, did you kiss me back? <laughs> yeah, I did. So what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're having fun with this. I thought this was gonna be so worse than it was for you. It, it is still bad for me. At least you're having fun. I'm only having fun because you're making mistakes and I'm not having to read the bad parts. Fuck you. <laughs> Realizing his mistake. Force anger immediately left his body. He hurriedly covered his mouth with his hand, shutting himself up. Three looked at him unexpectedly. You kiss me? He asked. Force sighed defeatedly. Yeah, are you mad? I just don't get why you would do it, Three said. Uh, well, I just didn't want to hurt the other three's feelings. Yeah, that's it. I don't want to feel bad by rejecting him, so I just went along with the kiss. Four lied, with a nervous smile plastered on his face. Three crossed his arms and raised an eyebrow. Let me get this straight. You kiss a version of me so that you wouldn't hurt his feelings? Uh, yes? Do you have to practice being that bad at lying or are you just that naturally shit at it? <laughs> Three said with a deadpan tone. Four sighed as his shoulders sank in defeat. <laughs> yeah, he gets no bitches. <laughs> <laughs> like Luke. <laughs> <laughs> that means like two things right now for me right now. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, one, because like the Luke that we know that we you constantly make fun of and everything, but also like the creator of the whole SNG4 thing is also named Luke and he canonically gets no bitches also. <laughs> so <laughs> it, it's, it's, it's funny for two reasons. <laughs> it's a joke within a joke. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Well, can you blame me? You're not a- You haven't made it- You've made it abundantly clear that you want nothing- That- Fuck. God damn it. <laughs> you have made it abundantly clear that nothing would ever happen between us, and when I saw a version of you that did want something with me, I- I couldn't help myself. Even if it wasn't actually you, I just couldn't pass up the chance to know what it's like if we were- If we had what was- What was more than- Four shook his head to clear his sauce and looked down in shame. I just had to know what it was would be theoretically to be be like if you actually gave me a chance. I know that you would never want to kiss me in this universe, so it really was the only chance I would ever get to know what <laughs> God damn it. Four was cut off mid sentence by the feeling of three firmly pressing his lips against fours, as in four's face Face red, fully red, as he stared wide-eyed at his meme partner. 
The kiss wasn't as tender as the one he shared with the other SMG3, but it somehow felt more real. Less like a fairy tale since this one was the real SMG3. His SMG3. It didn't take long for three to pull away, for we're still frozen in shock. There, now you now we kiss here as well, so you can stop with your complaining. And also, no more kissing alternative versions of me, got it? Three said with a frustra with frustration laced in his voice. Ah, uh, fuck. Where was I? <laughs> <laughs> Still processing what, what just happened. Ford didn't give much more than a timid nod, making Three smirk. Good. Now, if you excuse me, I have a coffee shop to run. Three turned around and headed to the door, leaving, leaving Ford standing alone in the center of the room. Later, loser. Three said, exiting the castle. Bye, Three. Four muttered. His mind was running a thousand miles a minute as he flooded with even more questions. Wait, so this means he actually likes me? He kissed me, so maybe he does? No way, he only did it to make you stop whining over the fact that you never kiss. But what about the comment about kissing all alternative versions of himself? Was he jealous? <laughs> Three, jealous of himself? That's ridiculous. For groan in frustration as his internal debate. Damn, why, why did Three always have to send him such confusing signals? The selfish prick. I bet you'd enjoy toying with Four like this, making him question their entire relationship every time we, they talked. Four was far far too mentally exhausted to deal with these questions right now, so he decided to do the only thing that would distract him for a few hours. Making memes. <laughs> he booted up his computer and got to work. However, the tingling feeling of Three's lips... Uh, against his own, never left his mind as he distracted himself for the rest of the day. They definitely have to talk about that one at some point, but right now, neither of them were quite ready for that. Ah, well, that'll be tomorrow's problem. And yes! It's done! It's done! It's done! It's done! <laughs> Why are you so happy about this? Yeah. <laughs> it's done! Yeah. <laughs> yeah! Brother, chill! Brother, chill! <laughs> I never have to read that shit again. It wasn't that bad. It was. <laughs> what? Shit. <laughs> you really hated I, it that much? I don't think I've ever been so relieved in my life. Damn. <laughs> I don't know what to oh, say that. I have the perfect image for my face the entire way through. Oh my god, <laughs> you almost made me do another spit take. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's yeah. pretty good. It's so me. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> it was. No, -uh. I would know. I yeah. read it. I hate it. Thanks. I still hate it, like everything about it. It hasn't changed the way I feel about these stupid purple and blue random Mario knockoff men. I still hate them. <laughs> I'm looking at you like that like weird hamster with the big eyes with the fucking sad <laughs> violin in the background. <laughs> I'm still looking at you like that fucking cat. <laughs> Okay, despite it being about these two Australian guys, can you tell me, like, how do you feel about it? Like, did you like how it was written or some like the the concept? It was all right. All right, you get two thumbs up from <laughs> Sage. <laughs> nah, just like a half thumbs up. Okay, you know? like a five out of ten because it's S and D three four. Well, ten would be two thumbs up, so I would say it's like a three and a half. Wow. Yeah. You know what? <laughs> if Potato is watching this, this does not represent my feelings. This goes for a ten out of ten in my book. This was awesome. <laughs> Sage hated it, though. <laughs> mm-hmm. But, Sage, you know what it's time for? It's time for Will No, time. I don't know what it's time for. Will time, will time, will time, will time, will time, will time, will time. If it lands on something, I'd... Mm. <laughs> I'm you going <laughs> so mad. Okay, just, just tell me when to press it, okay? What? Uh, I'm looking at the options. <laughs> okay, you press it. Alright. I'm hoping for radio silence, actually. 
Ay, uh. <gasps> uh, oh. Uh, <laughs> Cherry uh. bomb makes her pinches. Oh my god. <laughs> you know what? You'll take it? That's not bad. <laughs> I'll take it. Alright. I guess we're about <laughs> straight couples now. What the fuck? Oh, <laughs> uh, yay. Yay. <sighs> oh, God. Yay, you're loving life right now. I can feel it through the monitor. I wouldn't say I'm loving life because I've still had to read that and it's ingrained in my brain. <laughs> but you know what? It's you're over and done with. I, I've done it. <laughs> I've done it, guys. I'm so great. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell Elf like the war is over. <laughs> It's like that like Elf immortal snail. <laughs> no, this is Christmas. <laughs> that is so funny because I actually have a personal vendetta against that Christmas snail. <laughs> oh, this is Christmas. <laughs> it's okay. You got you got through it. Elf is gonna have so much to clip from this fucking video. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. You have any final thoughts? Anything you want to share with the world? To anybody that is watching this and is a genuine fan of these weird people, I oh, don't know why me. you would be. Oh, okay. <laughs> Shush, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> anybody else in the world that watched this because they thought, oh, it's going to be a great video, SMG3, 4 fanfic, yay. And you just hear me screaming in the background, I'm so sorry. But, <laughs> you know, oh well. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Get a better ship. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> get fucking good. Do something with your life. <laughs> Damn. Well, anyway, thank you, Sage, for joining. Even though you hated this, I could feel you dragging your feet through this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And then uh, on screen is a, is a playlist of all the other Wattpad book club readings that I've done. Including the last one that's on screen, which I can't remember because it's it's been a little bit. I don't know. Someone else look at it for me. I'm too tired. And then, <laughs> and then thank you for safe for joining. I, I appreciate you. I'm gonna I'm gonna get uh, a you're very called welcome. on me. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it in the air. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave you in silence now. Thank you. Alright, well, anyway, my name is Phoenix, that was Sage, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye!